Now, the WGAL News 8 Storm Team Forecast with meteorologist Tiffany Savona. It has been an active and snowy month across the Susquehanna Valley. Let's talk about snow totals so far this season. We'll actually go back to last season when we saw 5.1 inches of snow at the Harrisburg Airport. This season, so far, 31.9 inches. The average snow total for the season is 30.6. So we are already over an inch above average and it's only in the middle of February. So it has been a snowy year so far. We're taking a live look out of our Lancaster sky cam down toward Penn Square and you can see that the main roads there downtown look just wet at this time, but I bet there are still some slick spots, especially on the back roads, the secondary roads and sidewalks because we had some sleet and freezing rain overnight and temperatures are still below the freezing mark. So the light snow and sleet coming to an end early this afternoon were mostly cloudy then with temperatures into the low and middle 30s. We turn partly cloudy and breezy tonight, lows in the 20s, but feels like temperatures will be in the teens and tomorrow it stays breezy. Highs around 32. I think we will start off with the sunshine before the clouds fill in and it's going to feel like the teens and 20s tomorrow. So you will need to bundle up. Right now it's 32 in Lancaster, 31 in Harrisburg, 30 in York, 32 degrees in Gettysburg. Some more locations getting to that 32 degree mark. That is nice to see. Super Doppler 8 showing the steady precipitation east of us. We still have a little bit of light snow lingering into eastern Lancaster County, eastern Lebanon, and also into southeast York County, east of I-83. But this is the last of it as an area of low pressure continues to move away from us. We are going to see this precipitation shut off off this afternoon. As we take you into tonight, I think the clouds break up a bit. I think we start off with plenty of sunshine tomorrow morning. It's going to be cold though. Temperatures in the teens. Clouds quickly fill in by the mid to late morning hours tomorrow. And then we're just partly sunny to mostly cloudy cold with high temperatures around 32. Again, wind chills in the teens and 20s tomorrow. We go into Sunday and I think Sunday will be your better weekend day. High pressure moves in. So that allows the winds to relax. And by Sunday afternoon, I think we will see plenty of sunshine before those high clouds push in. Sunday highs in the middle 30s. Let's go ahead and go to Sunday night into early Monday morning. This is when our next storm system will be moving in. It looks like snow could be moving in by the morning commute. Another computer model has it coming in a little bit later. So we'll be watching this very closely, but then it looks like some warmer air moves in behind a warm front. So we could see that snow change over to rain during the day on Monday. So we'll be watching that. We could be making that an impact day on Monday, but let's not worry about that right now. Let's just focus on the weekend. We're going to be drying things out and we'll definitely see more sunshine, especially on Sunday, Brian.